hey everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video we're going to be decorating my living room doing a little bit of spring cleaning and also a tour i hope you guys enjoy this space right here i got it off home goods i believe i paid 15 dollars for it and it made such a big difference i'm going to show you how it looked before and how it looks after with the base. This is how I had it before. I mean, it doesn't look bad, it looks cute, but when I added that base, it just brought it to life. It looked more fuller, it was taller, it was much nicer. I believe I still have the tag for it. I have the link down below for everything that you see in this room, and if I cannot find it, I will definitely have similar items. I used to have a Paris painting from Ikea, then I took it down. I have always changed it up many times, but I finally found um, the canvases that I'm going to be placing on this wall. A jumper for when we had Leo, and Athena got a chance to use it as well, so we're going to get rid of it. It will no longer be there. This end table, I will eventually replace it. I'm not sure when, but... Um, I do have to get rid of it. I just, I don't know, it kind of matches the floor. So same with the coffee table. So it ties everything all nicely, like the whole dark brown with gray and green. I really love the vibes. And as you can see, I have also a pup of gold. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep that or if I'm going to get rid of it. But we'll see as we go. One thing that you can also do to upgrade your home, little things that are going to make a difference, is for example this light switch. I'm going to change the case because honestly it's pretty beat up <laughs> and I want something a little bit more glam. I do follow Kate. I believe her Instagram is all things Katie and she inspired me to change my light switch. I'm going to show you guys what she shared in her Instagram stories. As you can see, I have some toys that I do not like. And this is a mirror. It's actually pretty big, but on this video, it kind of looks small. Okay, and that wall right there is going to be covered with the pretty paints that I got. completely forgot about these baskets. I got them when Toys R Us and Babies R Us was closing down and I purchased this set for I believe 30 bucks and it comes with it comes with five different um, size baskets and I'll show you guys real quick. This is where I'm going to be placing all the toys that I have on this side by the mirror over here because I don't like the way they look. At the beginning they look really cute but now it looks all over the place. So we're gonna make them look nicer. Look how cute the baskets are. I don't know why I forgot about them, but I'm glad that I saw them right now. And I'm gonna be placing all their toys on this one. And this too, I'll see where I place them. I know that one, I wanna put it in uh, the kids' bathroom. And that's gonna go in the kids' bathroom. We're gonna organize this part of the house, which is all those toys right there. I do not like the way they look. And we're gonna store them in that little container that you see back there. And pick the ones that they wanna keep and the ones that they don't. We're gonna donate them to Goodwill. We got rid of the bouncer. I'm gonna give it away. This is real life, you guys. We're gonna go over all these toys and just keep a few because honestly, I don't think we need them all because we still have some more down there over here we have the trash can because some things belong in the trash that are in the toys all of athena's toys and in here i'll be putting all of leo's toys so we're gonna choose leo okay we narrowed it down to all this only we got rid of a lot and also down here 
And as you can see over here, we used to have three baskets. Now we have two, and that's even better. I'm gonna dust everything out and vacuum the carpet because there was a lot of crumbs. And now I'm gonna take a little break. How is it, Athena? So yummy. <laughs> Now I'm gonna clean the mirrors with, Back! Back! <laughs> with this cl uh, glass cleaner Back! and they're gonna look so nice. Okay you guys, now that I finish doing everything, cleaning and organizing, I'm gonna show you the final look. And this is what we got. Voila! This is our living room. I played around with the sofa and the pillows over there. I had some sparkly ones. Um, those are the picture frames that I showed you guys on a previous video. I believe it was a shop with me and also a haul. They are stunning. I did notice that if you see the frame on this side, it looks gray. And right here looks white. So I'm going to have to paint it so that they all match because we knew that this one was not the same color as the other two but i'm gonna make it work and over here you can see my little coffee area coffee table <laughs> with all the toys under eventually i would like to get the sea gallery um uh coffee table i'll link it down below if you guys are interested in checking it out and maybe you guys want to purchase it then over here we have my beautiful console this is stunning. I love it. It's so, oh, it's so me. The other day, I went to Home Goods and I found some beautiful sconces. I'm debating whether if I should keep them or not. The sconces they match perfectly with this piece of furniture that I got. So I was thinking of putting one right there and right there. I know C Gallery ones retail for like about a hundred. The ones that I got from Home Goods were thirty each, but they're stunning, you guys. I cannot wait to show you guys on my next haul and we'll see if I keep them or not. And everything you see here, it is from my favorite store, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, you know the drill. <laughs> I thought it was so cute. I paid $3.99. Then we have some, um, what's it called? Ooh, I forgot the name, but they're marble <laughs> here. Oh, brain fart. What are they called? Okay, coasters, I remember. And then we have this beautiful flower. $7.99 home goods whenever golden hour hits here um, where I live this room lights up so much there is so much uh, light and rainbows and it looks so so pretty maybe because all the sparkles that I got going on you can see I have some pillows you see that reflection right here that's how my whole living room looks. not the entire living room but most of it looks just like that you see those sparkles and that light right there you see it on this other wall right here i can truly say that i'm in love with my living room i feel like i might be missing something right here but it's okay for now i will be incorporating pinks and blues into my home decor this year so stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below what you enjoy the most about this living room tour. We did a little bit of spring cleaning. Also decorate so with a living room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to show you how this place looks at night and then we'll wrap it up.
This table runner that you see on the table, and this is what I usually keep there. I'm going to be taking the tray off as you guys saw earlier. And that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy um, seeing my home and the tour. But right now, I'm loving the way everything flows. I might replace this little tree right here, but... Uh, I'm still thinking about it. We'll see how it goes. What I love the most about the living room is that it's very neutral and I can always bring in any color, for example, blue, yellow, pink, and it will all look so well. I changed it up a little bit for the coffee table since it was a little tall. I replaced it with this one right here. I showed you guys on a previous video. Let me turn on the light so that you can see how it looks. Let me know in the comments down below which one do you prefer, the big arrangement or the smaller arrangement. And over here you can see that I glued this back on because Leo broke it earlier. It took a second. <laughs> but that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this. Decorate with me slash living room tour slash spring cleaning. <laughs> I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye! This is how it's gonna stay. We take the tray off because um, Leo might get all over it. He actually did after I was finished filming, and he broke my little my little thing. I'll show you guys when I do the tour at night. But I was able to fix it, and my hands are like super hard because of the crazy glue that I used.